Are you ever a pilot? No, no, I'm a pilot, but I'm not your pilot today. I got someone else doing it. Is that a good thing or a bad thing, Craig? Oh, that's probably a good thing for you. No, no, cut, cut. <laughs> I've been flying for almost 40 years, so it's time for the younger guys to take it over. So here we are. We, we were told that you were the Red Lake model uh, and a pilot. Jeez. Is that true? or? I don't know if those are the facts. I'm, I'm going to be your pilot, though. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> It's like either a pilot or a model. Isn't it? <laughs> Which one are you better at? <laughs> well, you better hope I'm a better pilot. I don't know. Yeah. Kevin pissed off the pilot, and now he's getting the external seat. <laughs> Not good. So is this your business then? Yes. Yeah. So is it is Viking? Viking Outpost. My brother and I, we own Viking Outpost. Yeah? Yes. And wait, what started the business? Well, my father and mother started in 1947 on, the, on Douglas Lake in the park. And uh, my mother's still alive, 98 years old, lives at home, and uh, we're still doing it. We're, uh, we're weighing our equipment uh, before we get on the plane, and this is what we got for 11 or 12 days uh, for four of us. Uh, it didn't look like much until we put it on the scale. Hey, I'm Harlan Schwartz, uh, owner of Red Lake Outfitters. We're a canoe outfitting operation based out of beautiful Red Lake, Ontario here, and we outfit into Woodland Caribou Provincial Park. All right, here we are at Red Lake. We uh, couldn't fly out last night because something about a tornado touching down. I, I think the pilot was a sissy pants, to be quite honest. What's the main thing that people get uh, from uh, being here after a trip when they come back? Uh, well, the, the two things that we offer and what most people come back satisfied with is uh, the solitude. You know, fewer than 700 paddlers a year are paddling in the park. Makes it a, a unique experience where you're not going to see too many people. Uh, so the solitude aspect of it and world-class fishing. Uh, great fishing for walleye, lake trout, northern pike. Uh, it's uh, it's world-class fishing. You're not going to see many people and have a good time. Kevin, you're going to be fulfilling the role of plain steward, okay? So keep the cocktails coming and we'll be good to go. <laughs> so what made you start the business up here, huh? Uh, well, we, uh, we have a great area here, obviously, uh, world-class paddling destination, and we just wanted to, to get the message out and, and share it with the world. And are you excited about uh, finally going to the woods? Yes, definitely. I get to have my own private plane. So, Bill, <laughs> we're about Kevin. to go. It's a nice day to fly in the air. For ducks. Are you flying the plane or is the pilot? Um, well, I'm going to wait till we get up, and then I'm going to kind of take over the, the controls and see what happens. What's it like for going in the woods with three males? Well, we're getting ready for the photo shoot for Men's Health and Cosmo, so we're, um, it's going to be good. <laughs> uh, you got anything to say about that, Andy? Um, I uh, I have no independent recollection of that event. So we went, we stayed at Dorothy's place, a bed and breakfast down the road, and it was uh, marvelous. So we're heading out this morning to uh, fly into the park. Uh, really, I don't know about you, Andy. Andy is the one filming right now. Uh, uh, but I'm really excited to be actually be in the woods for for because it's been a long drive. We drove, drove from Peterborough, so it's basically been three days to get here, and uh, we're about to to fly off into the wilderness. Well, the plane just took off, left us on uh, on Artery Lake, and uh, we had a snack, and we're just going to head out. Everybody is really pumped to be here. It's a uh, it's not very nice weather, but we don't really care. <laughs> it's uh, taken us three three days really to, to get here, and then flown in, and finally in the park. And we got a couple weeks to explore it. Looking forward to it. It's nice to be out. It really is.